You're about to meet a group of local inmates trying to steer teens in the right direction. Scene reporter Paul Gutierrez joins us with more. Paul? It's through a program called Life of Crime. Inmates are getting the chance to right their wrongs, even change many lives. You're about to meet two of them who are making a difference from behind bars. This is a sound inmates Pierre Michel and Linda Robowski wake up to. Since my ability to make choices have been stripped. It's really like being a kid again. It's a life both wouldn't wish on their worst enemy, and they're determined to spread their message and teach others by their example. Each week, they talk to teens, begging them not to make the mistakes they did. Students and inmates come together, either with their families or because of a court order, to scare teens straight. You're definitely not ready for the inside. Better make amends with your parents. Better buckle down on that school book. There's no easy way out. They should know. Their crime careers lasted for over 20 years. Probably I would still be out there passing counterfeit money until finally when I did get caught, the amount would have been so high, I'd have been looking at life. As for Pierre, he left Canada to buy cocaine and got caught. Money. Money was my first temptation. But now they've redirected their lives to help reshape others. Pierre is coming up on a transfer within the next week. As for Linda, she gets out in May. The Life of Crime program may have started back in early October, but since then, more than 20 schools from across the valley have heard Pierre and Linda's message. Ben, Shara, back to you. Thank you, Paul.